Okay, good morning, everybody. Um, welcome to this daily currency call where Jin shares his analysis and ideas for a specific currency for each day. So the usual schedule of the week is Monday, Aussie and Kiwi, Tuesday, Euro, Wednesday, Pound, which is today, Thursday, Yen and Gold, Friday, Canadian Dollar. So today I see many new names. Um, yeah, but do help me do this poll. Is this your first time here? Yeah. So while you guys are filling out the poll, uh, a disclaimer here. So yeah, this webinar is going to be very beneficial to both long-term investors and short-term traders. We will be going through what could move prices, possible trade ideas, and also highlighting potential targets and risk. So any information shared during this session is not intended to be a trade recommendation. It is solely the opinion and views of the speaker. So please remember to do your own analysis prior to entering any trades. So quick look at the poll. Yeah, we do have quite a few new uh, first timers here. So before I move on, do let me know how did you get here. So while you guys are putting up this poll, a quick introduction about Jin. So Jin is the founder of LCMS Traders and Forex Briefcase. He teaches members of the LCMS Traders Club on how to trade FX and for Forex briefcase, he trades more than US $10 million account on a daily basis for his managed account clients. And he is also an international speaker where he speaks in countries like Hong Kong, UK, US, Australia, Malaysia, Vietnam, Indonesia, Singapore, Malaysia, sharing his views about the FX market. So yeah, just click on the poll again. Yeah, I do see a lot of you coming in from the Telegram channel and a lot of friends sharing this uh, currency call. So I would like to take this opportunity to share with you about the LCMS Traders Club. Yeah, so this is the LCMS Traders Club, a private group on Facebook where we teach, guide, signal and coach you to be a better and more profitable trader. So regardless of whether you are new to trading, experience, part-time or even you are full-time trading, um, yeah, this is the place to be. So if you have joined us from the Telegram, this may look familiar to you, our signals. Um, we, give it, we give out these signals for free in our Telegram channel. But a question you might have is, we have told you when to get into a trade, but you do not know where to exit. So in the Traders Club, we not only give you these signals earlier than the Telegram channel, we also share with you the strategy behind the signals, the thought process before we fire out the signals and we guide you on where to exit as well. So this is how the analysis looks like. So if you are part of the four day course, you will soon learn how to use these five steps. And then uh, we actually tell you where to exit. So in the Telegram channel, we show you 20 pips, 40 pips, 60 pips, but we don't really tell you when is the ideal time to exit. For, for this case, we do show you uh, suggest to secure profits. When do you want, do we want you to hold the trade? Etc. Etc. So these are things you don't get in the Telegram channel. So why we do this? Because in the long run, you not only earn from the signals, you get to learn how to trade better as well. So if you want to learn new strategies too, uh, we have members only live Zoom sessions on Monday and Wednesday evenings to run through trade ideas. Um, yeah, run through trade ideas, strategies, update you on recent economic developments. So. Um, yeah, just one of the examples here, one of the uh, current, Monday's currency call with Jin. So usually on Monday, we, the current, uh, sorry, the weekly live call is with Jin. So um, we do a last week's economic roundup, we do some signals coaching, um, and then Jin will do some group coaching, discussing about psychology, full-time trading, and then identify trades. So yeah, this is what we do on every Monday. And on every Wednesday, we actually give you some tutorials so that you can be a more all-around trader. So we teach you about trend, candlestick patterns, chart patterns, divergence. Yeah, so you get all this um, information on our twice a week webinars. So um, yeah, on so especially on Monday, this is the best time to pick uh, on Jin's, pick Jin's brain on pretty much any tra trading related questions you might have. So lastly, as you can see over here, there are a lot of uh, other features that you can uh, uh, explore, like our daily analysis, our currency watch list. So 
um, breaking news analysis. So it's all here to provide you with all the information to shortcut your way to trading success. So, so to join the group, it's very simple. Hop on to this link, 4daycourse.lcms.com.sg. I will post the link later. So yeah, we can read through all this. And then, oh, sorry, the Traders Club. I got the right thing wrong. wrong. <laughs> yeah, okay. You can hop on to tradersclub.lcms.com.sg. So you can read through all these and then the features here. And yeah, scroll all the way down, click on this button, 109 a year. And yeah, this, the group is only 109 a year, which is less than a dollar a day. So, you know, if you need some guidance, you are facing uncertainty in your trading or taking unnecessary risk, you need to join this club to get uh, the confidence and a proper strategy to trade immediately. So yeah, with a group of coaches, with Gene around, with senior traders around, your trading journey will definitely be uh, enjoyable and profitable. So yeah, do hop on to this group as soon as you can. With that, I'll pass the time now to Gene for the currency call. <coughs> so um, today is Wednesday, feels like a Friday. Absolutely exhausted right now. Um, Today is Wednesday, we are talking about the pound, dollar, you know, we've seen big movements overnight. Um, so quite a bit of things to talk about, you know, it's at some levels now that we could see some big moves further ahead. Um, the link is there, Traders Club. I think Jim was just half sharing about the four day course. I do think most of you are in the four day course already. Actually, if you could help me out, you know, um, put it in the chat, put it in the Zoom chat right now. Are you in a four-day course? Or if you don't know anything about the four-day course, say no, say you're not in a four-day course, so we know what to tell you about. Hello? Yes, yes. Anyone not in the four-day course? And those of you who are, do you like the first day? Do you like day one of four days? Yes, 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 yes. All right. Okay, good. So I will not be going through the whole four day course um, info again. But what I really just want to remind everyone to do is to, you know, make sure you have your, um, live account, register for your live account, make sure you fund it. You know, you can even get into Traders Club without um, without that 199, you can get in absolutely free. All you need is your live account fully funded. Um, Bill, how to join the four day course? The link is there, just click join. The videos are there available for you to watch. You have just missed day one, so not too late to join right now. All right. Uh, with that, I want to show you one more thing. Move that away. Traders Club members, Traders Club members, make sure, make sure you take note of this non farm payroll competition is happening this Friday again. Last month, we had Ivan who had the exact non farm payroll number, won a hundred dollars. Amazon voucher, won $100 Amazon voucher. Um, if you cannot get the exact, the closest without going over will win $50 Amazon voucher. So Traders Club members, make sure you put in your guess here. It doesn't cost you anything to guess. All there is is upside, no downside. So make sure you put in your guess, get that chance to win that $100 or $50 Amazon voucher. With that, um, I did have some questions from people asking me about um, the difference between using Forex Trading Asia or, I'll put this in here, Forex Trading Asia or Forex Factory, okay? Um, truth be told, not much difference between the two apart from Forex Trading Asia. We actually put in a lot of our analysis. We do a lot of our write-ups. Um, with the team of analysts and myself giving you all views about what we do, about how to, where we see the markets, where it's heading. And also, if you join, you register and you rate articles, you get points for interaction.
through that points, you can actually, um, where is it? Redeem your points for $20 or $5 Amazon vouchers. I think we'll have $100 coming up soon as well. So you actually get paid for reading news, rating them, taking advantage of what you learn from here, not just in terms of trading, but also in terms of earning that points to redeem for Amazon vouchers. Okay, so just to please some of you, I'm also going to be using Forex Factory today just to show you, Forex Factory is up, right? Yep, just to show you the news. Not much differences. Um, we had some Aussie GDP numbers come out today. Good news on the Aussie. So you've seen some Aussie upside, not significant because um, it's been quite priced in. Aussie is at quite a high level. Um, but with the pound dollar focus today, we are looking at any pound news. Not a lot of pound news. You notice not a lot of pound news all the way to Friday where the US dollar non-farm payrolls. However, one thing to pay attention to is, where is it? Um, it's a bit messy here, right? So a bit too much info. You, you need to filter it down. There was some news further down about um, a Brexit optimism, Brexit deals possible coming through before the end of the year. Um, so that actually led to a lot of upside, big upside in the pound dollar. Okay, so you can use Forex Factory. I would suggest using Forex Trading Asia because, you know, we filter it down a bit more for you with my analysis there. But looking at the charts, the pound dollar here on the H4 time frame. Um, the last time we spoke about this last week, I said that it was going to come down to about the 1.33 level before resuming upwards to test the 1.34 level. It has done that right now, um, that big upward move testing 1.34. I do think we could see further upside as this Brexit positivity comes around. Uh, the momentum for US dollar weakness pushes the pound dollar a bit higher again. One thing you might want to take note of is I don't have any levels up there. So I would go into the daily time frame, zoom out, still struggle to find a level, go into the weekly time frame just so that I find a level for sure. I'm not going to be considering 1.4, way, way too far ahead. Um, I'll definitely consider something around 1.37. Right, it is currently now at 1.34, so 1.37 might be an idea, or even 1.36. So I might move that up a little bit at 1.36. So coming back to the H4 time frame, if it does break above 1.3432, I'll zoom in one more so that you don't have to squint too badly. All right, so if it does break above 1.3432, we could see the pound dollar move up towards 1.36, right? We could see that move upwards towards that 1.36, but I think that, you know, it will not be a, that straight line upwards. Um, as with all Brexit discussions and all Brexit deals, um, there is always the yes deal, no deal, deal, no deal scenario causing a lot more volatility to the pound dollar. So I think it could go up towards 1.36. Um, you could be looking at a maybe a 50 pip stop loss for a good 130 pip take profit, 140 pip take profit. Very good risk reward payouts at this point, but you will have to wait for it to go up and break above this 1.34 level, okay? Um, over the past eight hours, it has, or over the past 12 hours, it has been resisted at this point. So um, I think that it might sit at this level for a little bit before possibly breaking higher. If it does reject downwards from 1.34, I would be very cautious um, not to sell into this position because of that big upward trend direction, unless we see very clear evidence in terms of fundamentals, whether it's a no deal, whether Brexit is being called off, or whether we see some big strength in the US dollar pulling 
the pound US dollar down from 1.3432. So the main thing, if you are taking notes, and I hope you are, is to look for buying opportunities in the pound dollar. Almost break that resistance, look to buy. If there's any dips, look to buy. Um, don't be looking to sell the pound dollar at this point in time. All right, so with the pound dollar, as usual, we will look into the euro pound. Um, euro pound, as we spoke about it yesterday, um, I said that it was possibly going to go up and test 8978. Let me zoom in one more. I said it was going to go up and test 8978. Um, last night, we did a very quick session with Traders Club members, and I did an update on that saying that given that it's breaking 8978, um, we possibly could see it go up towards 9024 before seeing any further downside. I still think that that's going to happen. I still think that we could see, maybe stretch it out a little bit. We could see it go towards 9024 before we see any further downside on the euro pound. Um, so I'll take that one away. Okay. The reason why I see further upside um, towards 9024 before coming back down, that upside push is probably going to be driven by the Euro US dollar climbing up. It is at 1.2 right now. It looks like it's going to continue climbing at 1.2. Looking at the daily time frame, it's still scaling up significantly. Um, I think that that is going to pull. I'll zoom in a bit more. I think that that is going to pull the euro pound higher because of what the euro US is doing. So that's why I think it's going to go up. Um, then with that volatility from the pound dollar, you know, reaching significant highs, a lot of volatility going to come in into taking profit, people taking profits on the pound dollar, pulling it back down or the euro US pulling it back down again. That's also one reason why I think um, I could see that downward move from the euro pound as pound dollar continues going higher. Euro pound is going to come down. As people take profit on the euro dollar, we could see it start turning back down again. That's probably going to pull the euro, back, the euro pound back down again. So that looks like a good um, set up as it approaches 9024 um, for that big reversal trade. Possibly, you know, um, possibly 30 pip stop loss for a good 100 pip take profit. Significant downside move if it rejects that 9024 resistance level. Okay, so um, a lot of things shared at this point. Um, Andy just asked, what's the difference between my red and blue support resistance lines? No difference, just um, at different times of the day, I've drawn in a line. I don't know why it's red or I don't know why it's blue. So um, no, no difference in terms of color, No, not levels of importance or that kind of stuff. Just a preference in changing colors around. All right. Okay. So with that said, uh, make sure for all of you who are already in the four day course, make sure you watch the video again, ask questions, interact. We do, we are giving away two accounts with $10,000 each um, for people who interact, post on social media, um, ask questions, and also have your trading account, your live trading account with that uh, through the link with the $1,000 funded you stand a chance to win 10,000 US dollar fully funded trading account. And those of you who are not already in the course, make sure you join the four day course. The link is there already. With that said, I'll pass it back to Jinwei. Hey, thank you, Jin. So uh, before you guys leave, do let us know how did we, how do you think of this webinar? And I'm going to post up all the links right now in the chat. So join our YouTube, subscribe to our YouTube channel for our daily recordings, Telegram channel for our free signals, and the Traders Club link, as well as the four-day course link here if you want to find out more about the thought process of getting into trades and learning how to trade better.
yeah so looking forward to see everyone tomorrow for the four day course day two and yeah see you guys tomorrow bye